What's up Trophy Hunter, for 13 years PlayStation trophies have been at the back of every PlayStation owner's mind. And probably you know that the Platinum is the final milestone of any trophy list. And it will only unlock once you've unlocked every single trophy a game has to offer. However, trophy hunting has changed a lot in the recent years. Here is a quick example, let's travel back to the year 2009. One of the first easy platinum games ever, Hannah Montana the movie. You still need 4 hours to unlock the platinum. But like I said before, things have changed and nowadays it's possible to unlock plenty of platinums without spending hours of hours playing video games. So in this video I will try to make the impossible possible by unlocking 5 platinums on 5 different games in 5 minutes. But to be honest, it's basically pretty easy. First I made a new account called Trophy, as you can see I have zero trophies, zero platinums. The guy in the corner is already laughing his ass off, because he will earn a lot of platinums in a short time. During my platinum run I will tell you a bit about the games, because probably you want to buy one of the games. So the timer will start as soon as I start the first game. We will start with the game Bowling Boars. The game is just one dollar and can be completed in a few seconds. So let's start in 3, 2, 1, go! I forgot to mention this is the challenge mode edition. To get the platinum in this game all you need to do is you have to catch 11 bowling balls. Each ball gives you 100 points and you need a score of 1100 points. As you can see I already made a few mistakes but this is not a big deal. At the main menu if you hold down the left d-pad and start the game with the cross button the game becomes faster. The game is more luck based than skill based. So I already got the 1100 points so I switched immediately to the next game which is Sakura Succubus. The game is a visual knower. This one is a bit expensive, it's $10 but it's cross by between PS5 and PS4. So basically it's $5 per platinum. To get this done real quick the most important thing is that you go to settings, enable unseen text, transitions and after choices and last but not least set the text speed to fast. With these settings you can rush through the game within one minute. It's possible to choose between different answers but in the end it doesn't really matter which answer you choose, you will always end up with the platinum. So once you're done with the preferences, start the game and press the R1 button to skip through the text. So like I said before, it doesn't really matter which answers you choose, so keep choosing the first one. The game has a total of 6 stacks, so it's possible to get 6 platinums. In total there are 4 Sakura Succubus games, and each game can be completed within 1 to 2 minutes. But the first one is the easiest one because you can simply choose any answer. There are some spin-offs too like Sakura Swim Club or Sakura Nova. I believe the spin-offs are $12 but each of them are cross by 2. And of course they can also be completed in a few minutes. As you can see these kind of games require zero skill. So we are close to the 3 minute mark and we have 3 games left so this will be a close one. Compared to the other games this one feels very long but fortunately I'm done with it right now. No time to wait for the platinum, we're jumping right into the next game which is Quick Maths. This one is basically a game for kids. With the game you can learn math. The good thing about the game is it's only $1.50. So to get the platinum we're jumping right into any lever and first we need to enter the number 13. Then we need to enter the number 42 and last but not least we need to enter 69. And the last thing we need to do to get the platinum is we need to press 50 times the R1 button in each of the four modes. It is possible to get the platinum in this game four times. There is a PS5 and a PS4 version and they have a separate trophy list. So it's possible to get the platinum two times in the European version and two times in the North American version. Unfortunately the game is not cross by so you have to pay $1.50 for each version. So guys we are close to the 2 minute mark and we have still 2 games left. So this is the last mode in quick maths, after that we are done with the game. There is no time to wait for the platinum as soon as we hit the 50 examples we are jumping right into the next game which is Legends of Talia. I think this is the easiest and fastest platinum of all times. 
It's a wish you know, but there are no choices. So once the game starts, go to Preferences, Enable Unseen Text, After Choices and Transitions. And do not forget to set the text speed to fast. After that, start a new game, press the R1 button and after a minute you will get your Platinum. This one is basically pretty cheap, it's only $3 and cross by between PS4 and PS5. So you can get two Platinums in two minutes for just $3, which is basically a very good deal. In total the game has 6 stacks, so you can get the Platinum in this game 6 times. There's a Europe, a North America and a Japan version. And the game is available on PS5 and PS4 and like I said before, PS5 has always a separate trophy list. So guys, we are close to the 1 minute mark and we have one game left. And the problem is the next game is very luck based, because you need to be very quick and it's possible to mess up my entire run. The last game is called Bowling and yes, that's it. There are 3 rounds and you need to score 200 points. But the point system is kinda strange. However, the most important thing is that you are quick. So as soon as you see your boar, press the cross button. This one is a very cheap platinum, it's just $1 and there are 2 stacks, 1 stack for Europe and 1 stack for America. And here we go, I hit the 200 points. So basically I made 5 platinums in 4.5 minutes. Which is insane and all I can say is welcome to 2022. The only annoying thing on PS5 is it takes ages till you get all your trophies. So I couldn't resist and I got through the game a second time. But anyway the time is almost over. Well I would say with a bit of more trying it's basically possible to get 6 platinums. Maybe 7 in 5 minutes. Feel free to let me know what do you think about these easy and fast platinums. Did these games ruin the trophy hunting? Let me know it in the comment section below. So to prove that I got 5 platinums in 5 minutes on 5 different games, let's take a look at my profile. It's kind of funny because the trophies are still counting. During my test run sometimes the trophies stopped unlocking which was very annoying. But fortunately this time everything unlocked fine. So once finally the platinum will pop on bowling, we will take a quick look at the profile. Here we go, so as you can see I got 5 platinums on my profile. After this run now I'm wondering how many platinums I can get in 1 hour. Well I guess with stacks it could be possible to get 40 platinums in an hour. Which would be absolutely insane and probably also a world record. Well if you want to see probably a 1 hour platinum run let me know it in the comment section below. So guys that's it, I hope you enjoyed the video, thanks for the attention, see you in my next one.